Hey guys, what's up, sauce? Er, what's up? Back some more Call of Duty. And today, guys, look at all these guys over here. Look, look, look at the, look at the headquarters. We're back some World War II today. And let's just look at this. Everybody is doing jumping jacks in unison. Look at this. This was the amazing part about the headquarters. The whole gang coming together and being able to just, you know, just do a set of, you know, jumping jacks as a squadron, as a whole group. This is just absolutely hilarious. As you're watching everybody else opening their packs and getting absolutely nothing. Look at this man got legit a calling card, a frantic, a reticle, legit a reticle. Back in the day, you were able to get a reticle from a, from a care package. Imagine that, getting a reticle. That's mind-blowing to me. I don't think I've ever, I don't even remember seeing the reticle. Wow. What's this guy getting right here? I think we actually have a care package of our own. What's he getting? Another common, a legendary. Okay, there we go. He got a British Air Force. Okay, let's actually open one of our own. Hold on, we got a rare. Hold on, hold on. Let's throw it right in front of the, the whole jumping jack squad. Hold on. Uh, right there. Yeah, bam. Right there. Look, they're all doing their jumping jacks. It's okay. Okay, bam, bam, bam. I don't know what that red is. What is that? Valkyrie sniper? Hold on. That's actually cool, I guess. Yeah, that's sick. All right. Doesn't really matter because this game's like eight years old. But yeah, cool. Yeah, sure. Let me uh, view the collection. I'm slamming triangle to view the collection. Nothing, nothing's happening on any of them. So just guessing that just doesn't work anymore. So cool. All right. Dope, dope, dope. The fact that I just came in here, they're all doing jumping jacks. My God, hilarious. But hey guys, who today? I just thought, you know what? Let's hop back to some World War II. We haven't played in, uh, what, like two weeks, something like that. And I thought, why not? Yeah, let's grab our payroll, baby. Let's get it. And I thought, you know what? Let's just hop back in, uh, you know, play some World War II proper. The props on this game are just absolutely just, you talk about out there. My God, I've seen so. I've legit been a shoe as a prop. So th this game's got some awesome props as well. So I thought, you know what? Come back in here and, uh, you know. And you know, I always love the headquarters. You guys know I always love this. The whole idea of headquarters it reminds me of the whole Destiny thing. The whole Destiny, uh, what's it called? That whole, the beginning area of destiny where you like go and get all your gear and everything like that reminds me straight out of that game and it was just such an awesome idea i really did love it i really did i feel like if they did it initially in vanguard it'd be a better game just because it's a cool little thing like i mean look at their soul doing jumpy jacks i wonder what they're doing huh Little, little pee break. What's going on? But I really do not know. Let's go over to party game modes. Prop up. Bam, bam, bam. I really do not know if we're going to find any lobbies. I'm just hoping we are. Based on that headquarters right there, I'm pretty sure a lot of people are playing. It is the weekend, so I'm kind of hoping. But yeah, based on that headquarters, it was packed, my God. But back in the day, I remember going into the headquarters and just being there with your friends, being able to walk around straight like exactly like destiny if you guys have played destiny 1 destiny 2 the little area where you go in the beginning with all your friends everything like that get all your gear hang out just do your business you know go to your talk to everybody that you need to talk to that area straight from that game bam put in the call of duty it was absolutely amazing i love the idea i really did i think i talk about that headquarters every time i play this game because it's like it's just an awesome thing to just see like the headquarters like i, I really wish it was in the other one and uh we're, we're in there okay it's kind of an awkward start we're just kind of here okay all right i did just hear a whistle over here though i did just hear a whistle now the one thing about this prop punt that's a little iffy compared to the other ones is is the stun grenade now i've talked about it multiple times every time i play what's up brother how you doing every time i play this game i talk about how the stun grenade in world war ii has got to be the worst stun grenade in history actually i don't even think it's a stun grenade in this game it's a flash not a stun, a flash but the flash grenade in this game is absolutely just horrendous just just I, when we find a prop i'll show you guys because i mean you guys already know you guys already know how horrible it is i've complained about it multiple 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 times all i do is complain about the flash in this game because it is just it's mind hurting it really is mind hurting mind hurting that's not even a word what am i even saying here i go making up words again is that actually broke Wow. Yeah, the prop button in this game is a lot harder than any of the other games just because the flash. Yeah, honestly, just that, that's the flash. That's honestly just because of the flash. We're playing on console, so that's why the FOV looks a little a little squished together. It's not the normal 110 that we usually love to play with. What's this guy shooting at? My god. Okay, four seconds. I need to I need to start listening right now. I'm getting a little annoyed. It takes that long, just so everybody knows. That's that's how long it takes the flash to go off, and then you're supposed to actually find the guy. Mind blowing to me. Is he running? Is he running? Did you guys find him? What's going on over here? Oh, he is. They did. They did. Oh my god, it's a mortar shell. Hold on, boys. Okay, we got him. It's all good. It's all good. Jesus Christ, I forgot you could be the mortar shell. The ginormous mortar shell. Oh my god, the props in this game are absolutely hilarious. Now you can't, can't get much better than that. No, we literally can't get a mortar shell. Like, I think we were that last time. One time. Uh, last time I played this. So I actually wouldn't be against getting that again. All right, the lovely mortar shell. Uh, it's gonna go on intermission. Now, uh, what props we're trying to get here? I really do not know because I really do not know. Oh my god, and we got the mortar shell. We got that ginormous mortar shell. Now, where's the, what's the best idea or the best area for this mortar shell, you might be asking? I have absolutely no idea. We have a massive ass mortar shell. This thing, hold on. I have an idea. If we stick it in the uh, truck, right? And I have an idea. Hold on, hold on. Think about it, right? If we stick a few of them in here right one there wait no how do you decoy decoy is down arrow it's, it's different in this game down arrow right decoy a few of them in here how does that look i just want to see some nukes inside the uh inside the <laughs> It actually doesn't look that bad. Hold on. I, I might want to do it. I might want to do it. And then keep this one like right there. Like right. There. That's actually not that bad. It looks, it, do, it looks weird. Don't get me wrong. It looks very weird, but it looks like uh, nukes are, sp actually, no, they'd probably go in there and shoot that up. No, you got to put this in here. You got to put this in the middle down here. That's the best bet we got putting it down here. Cause this looks legit. A mortar shell randomly in this crater area. Like it looks, it looks like it's supposed to be here. Kind of. Yeah. I don't know what the play was putting the two mortar shells in the, uh, in the bus right there in the, uh, the trailer. 
bus trailer, the trailer, the uh, tractor, the tra I don't even know what it's called. My God, the thing that's on the rails out of the railway, the railway. Yeah, the railway. I'm, I'm getting lost over here. Right, the other good thing about this thing is it is massive. My God, speaking of massive, look at that thing. My God, that thing is ginormous. And then he changes to a small pig. Is that a pig with wings? Dude, I might want to switch just to see what that was. That, that It looked like he was had a pig with wings. And we are playing World War II, which is a really, really good. What is this? What is this? What is this? It's a... It looked like a, the nastiest mattress. Let's see. Yeah, look at it. It looked like... Oh, look at the piece of dookie on the mattress, too. That looked like the, the nastiest mattress I've probably ever seen in my entire life. Like, that's a mattress that you need to just throw away. Not even think about getting. That's a hard title. I don't know why. I just really like that title. And his name is Zombie Killer, so it kind of matches. Okay, but I was always saying, since this is a kind of older Call of Duty, that means the uh, the enemies that we're going against are not the brightest. And I've I've noticed that because they've walked past a few people a few times. So, uh, I kind of got to bear with the bad... Oh, they got a guy. I don't know what I'm saying. They killed one of our <laughs> teammates. It's all good. I legit thought I was going to be the only one that dies, which is usually how it is in, in prop when you're playing with your boy. I just feel like I go to the weirdest areas. I don't know. I, I Not the best idea of maker over here. So I noticed, right? You see the name at the bottom, Multi 101? I notice if I slam triangle, it goes up a little bit, right? So if I start really slamming it, right? Like, let's see if I can get it to the top. Come on. Come on. Can I get it to the top? Oh, this is going any higher. Oh, I was about to say, if I could get... It, it's not... Yeah, okay. Jesus Christ. I'm over here playing a game in a game. Wow, okay. Jesus Christ. It wouldn't go any higher. I don't know. All right, these four guys need to be found and eliminated immediately. I'm not even going to try to hesitate because we need to win this round. Even though if we did lose this round, we'd probably be able to play another one. Even though I do not know how the rounds work in World War II. I feel like it's like up to three rounds and then the game ends because uh, I feel like I've lost that round three thinking it's going to, you know, continue. But uh, whatever. All right, I heard a bunch of whistles back here. Look at him, look at him go, look at him go, look at him go. So I'm gonna throw this, right? And then it's gonna take 15 minutes. Look, it hasn't even... And then it goes off. It's like, what's the point? Yeah, at that point, it's already, he's already gone, though. At that point, he's already gone. Matter of fact, I'm just not gonna use the flash grenade anymore. I'm just done with it. I'm done using it. I'm done even trying to use it. It's just, it's not gonna happen. Definitely not gonna happen. I'm done with it. Like, I know you could be these bolts right here. You could be one of these chambers. I know that's one of the props. I know you could be like one of those boxes. That's another one of those props. I know it could be that horseshoe that you could jump on top. Okay, I was about to say that this guy was a problem, my god. So I know you could be that, I know you could be that horseshoe that kind of jumps on top of stuff, which is really cool. Look at him, look at him, look at him, look at him, look at him up there. Look at him, look at this, look at this man. You can, do you see this? Look at this, look at this, look at this. So, so you, look at the flash grenade, right? Let's, let's try to throw it. It actually worked, it actually, it, it kind of worked, it, it, it worked, but then it didn't work at the same time. What's the point? What's the point of even having that flash grenade? It does not do anything, does not even work. This man could play with me all day and night and it wouldn't even matter. Straight up Kid Cudi could play with me all day and night and it wouldn't even matter. I would never find this man because he's that bullet and it's impossible to hit. Even when I got that perfect kill on the flash, nah, still, still unable to get it, still unable. Still four guys remaining. I'm pretty sure we're never going to find any of these guys based on what I just saw right now, what I just witnessed. I don't know what that was. All I saw was a white screen, a plain white screen. It, it was absolutely horrible. Didn't like it one bit. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. This match right here might have been the hardest one I've ever played. I can't find any of these guys. I legit am listening for the whistles too. I'm legit trying to actively find these guys. Still, still can't do it. Legit still can't do it. I cannot play World War II prop put. This World War II prop put is definitely the hardest prop put just because of those stun grenades or the slash grenades. I almost, I barely got him as well. Barely got, look at my screen. White as day. That's absolutely horrible. The fact that your screen could be that white. Look at this. It, it's absolutely... I don't even know. It's horrible. I don't even know. Alright, change triangle. Bam. Oh my. Okay, we got the, uh, alrighty. This baby right here. Now, comment down below what you guys think this is, because, my god, it looks like an OG camcorder. Like a, uh, really, really OG one. Or not a camcorder. Whatever that thing's called. I completely forgot what it's called. The, uh, the, the tape, the tape thing that- I completely forgot what it's called. I'm gonna- I'm butchering it all the way home. All the way home. Where would I even be able to put this where it doesn't look, like, you know, weird? Because, like, right here, it, it obviously looks weird. It just looks weird anywhere. It's a project- projector. That's what it is. A projector. I actually losing my mind the fact that it took that long to- Think about a project. I don't. I don't know. I'm. I. They, they found me in two sex. I thought I'd be able to get away. No. No. I'm. I'm. No. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. I didn't like that one bit. I. I, 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 I thought I'd be able to get out easily, like I go. You know, usually do, but no. I. I I don't know. I, I, yeah, no, I have nothing to say. All right, guys, that being for today's video. Yeah, it was really fun coming back to World War II, but uh, honestly, at the same time, it reminded me of all the issues and all the problems that this game has because, I, Jesus, even in prop it, what are those flash grenades? I keep saying stun grenades. My God. Like, what are those flash grenades? I have no idea what those flash grenades are, and I don't know why I'm opening up a zombie crate. It really doesn't do anything for me, but I thought, you know what? I've been having them in my, you know, crate selection forever, so why not just get through them all and just, you know, waste them? But yeah, no, it was really fun coming back to World War II. It just kind of reminded me of all the, uh, the ickiness, all the disgusting stuff that I didn't like about this game but the one thing i did like about this game is this map already the, uh, the headquarters my god i always talk about it but look at this man what are you doing oh woman jesus christ i'm sorry i apologize for uh calling you a man sandwich hazel huh just holding a care package look at that look jesus christ look at that hand paint amazing i'll tell you what though this game's got a lot more stuff than vanguard does huh <laughs> what up for to do guys if you guys are doing the video please smash the like button down below really appreciate it and yeah thanks for watching guys i uh yeah catch you guys next video catch you guys tomorrow yeah i'm uh yeah